Hello, so I'm going to demonstrate AlphaSync Reckless Builder, also known as Alpha Builder or AlphaSync Reckless Maker. It's ambiguous. Regardless of that, this is the software. Now, a lot of people seem to be confused. I remember back in the day when I initially released it, I gave an instructional SoundCloud post, but that's not there anymore. Regardless, here is the program. So you've got file shortcuts to all of the functions of these buttons. Not sure why I put it in both places. Again, this is from 2017. I just updated it to fix some issues and to make it usable for myself. So if I switch to one of these lists, it adds some diphones as if as if they were just normal phonemes, which is useful for contexts. So you can ensure that you ensure that you've got a j before an R so that you know that your sample is jar. Regardless, these here, this is the list of the phonemes that you're using. And the reason this is here, you can edit it, you can refresh everything here. Diphones are all the combinations that you can possibly put in a rec list. And unused diphones are everything that you haven't added to your rec list. As you build it, these start to get subtracted. So if I was to recreate the Alpha Sing rec list by Kanru Hua, Park Dar Yal. So as you can see, if we go to the letter P, the phoneme P, and it's in order of how they're shown here. So. The only issue with this is that it doesn't separate par from par. Now I've done this, which is something I probably need to fix. Whoops. So if we scroll down, we've got pair, but before air is r, so it's taken par out of the list. And so has it done all of these. I'm not going to look for it. Now, if you click on one of them, it will select the equivalent, the same one on the other side. If you double click, you can then change what you've written. So you can change the phoneme or you can change the human readable. Now, if you click remove selection, it removes what you've selected. If you click on a diphone here that you don't want, so let's say you don't want je, je ignore, it's gone. Edit blacklist. It's been added here. So you can remove it from the blacklist. This will refresh and suddenly it's back. If you edit this list, you can take these, you can tell it not to use certain phonemes and when you click save those will be gone from the list here if you want them back there you go save and they're back again it's not the most efficient program but it's a nice 
helpful way to make a rec list when you're bad at keeping track of things yourself. You know. So, in addition, you can add custom phonemes. So, like, if you wanted to, you could add an R phoneme and etc. If I click save and close, it adds it to the list. If I go back, I can click remove, save, and it's gone. This search filter lets you search for specific phonemes. So if you wanted to work on everything with R, you go everything that's got the R phoneme if you want to check for R as the second phoneme in the diphone there you go it's only showing R as the second phoneme if you want to make sure you're finding R as the first phoneme so the one on the left there you go. Now you can find of, al, so for awa, aya, ar, as, ash, art. Now, the rest of the buttons, export is the biggest button because this is the one that exports what you've written to a rec list. Import will import an Oromo comment file as a rec list. Currently this is slightly bro broken based on the old format because it imports based on numbered file names so uh, don't trust it to work at the moment. I'm still currently working on changing things. Uh, save and load will save your rec list as a project file. So if I load this reckless file, this is a reckless I've started working on. If I want to change any of these, double click. And if I click export, I can export to documents. If I export it to Reckless Test 2019 and now go to Reckless Test 2019 RMO comment will show the comment file and Reckless will show the Reckless now I will open it in Oromo just to show that it works as I'm sure some of you will think oh does it actually work with Oromo if I can even find Excuse my cursed folder structure and cursed file naming. None of it, all of it is sarcastic because I never know what to call anything. So if you see anything that's offensive, I'm really sorry. And there you go. It works perfectly. And there you have it. 
of the Sing Reckless Builder. Enjoy.